Hi, I'm Dusty Shell, director with Usborn Books and More, here to share with you some excellent selections for the youngest members of your family, starting with this soft cloth book from our Hello Baby series. These have the little plastic handles with rattly bits for little hands to shake and chew and hold, and big, bold, bold, bold color illustrations for them. And hello, brown bear, hello, pretty peacock, and so on and so forth. They're really great to toss in your diaper bag or throw in the car seat. We also have our baby's very first Touchy Feely Colors playbook. Every page has little bits that they can feel and rub, or it might have finger trails or flaps to lift, just lots of things for little hands to interact with, a little fuzzy sun, as they also learn their colors. And we also have several different themes in this series as well. Muddle and Match is a very popular series because you'll see when you open it up, every page splits into three places so that the child can either read the story um, straight as it is with lots of fun alliteration which can tongue tie a parent if you're not careful while you're reading or they can turn the pages and mix and match the characters and the story all themselves and just make a silly time of it. Do you have a potty trainer? This is a good, good book for them. One is poop, or it's fun just for um, preschoolers just to learn about their body and how it functions. So it goes from talking about what poop is, um, if everyone poops, animals, it talks about all sorts of things and where it goes when they use the bathroom. A great flap educational book about a topic that all children love to learn about. I want to be an astronaut, really encourage imagination and also helps children to think about what they might want to do when they grow up and help them realize that they have the potential to do anything. And it just goes through starting with this little girl talking about, hmm, what do I want to do? And then every page is one of the things that she imagines from a race car driver to a stuntman to even through the end, I think if I get the right page, or there's the astronaut, but there's also, she can be a submarine commander or even a spy these are really great how to feed your cheeky monkey is part of a four book series we also have how to brush your teeth with snappy croc how to tuck in your sleepy lion and how to bathe your little dinosaur if you have a toddler or a young child who might resist these activities these can help show that they're just a normal part of your daily life and they can all be fun bright pictures as always I love how our illustrations are always so vibrant and draw the eye to them they follow their little monkey character through his day. All Better is a top, top seller. Whenever this goes out of stock, when it comes back, it sells out really quickly again. So if you think that you're just in love with this one, snag it now. Don't wait. What makes this so great is it comes with reusable, removable stickers. They're band-aids. As you can see, a couple of them are already floating on the pages. But you read through, and as the animals go through, they each have their own little accident, and they get boo-boos. I already have a band-aid on here, so I'll show you, actually. So you see, he hurt himself, oh no. So it says kiss it, and then you put a bandage on it, all better, and then you just keep going through and you can go back to the front and get your Band-Aid. Oh, the monkey bumped his head. So you kiss it, put a bandage on it, all better. And children just have a blast with these. We also have another book that's brand new that goes along with this in a similar vein. It's called Bear Needs Glasses, and instead of Band-Aids, you get glasses to try on different friends and characters. Peek inside a fairy tale. This one's Little Red Riding Hood with the little peekaboo cover and pages that tells the classic tale of Little Red Riding Hood as she journeys through the forest to go see her grandmother and then she encounters the big bad wolf. But it's your uh, a board book style for little hands and even has a couple of flaps for them to lift as well. My first word book about me really explores about themselves, their face, their body, the things they wear, the places they go. And even, I really love that it shows their feelings. Small children sometimes have a difficult time expressing how they feel, so this can help you teach them. Um, you know, point to the face that shows what you're feeling right now so you can discuss with them all the things that they have inside. And finally, 1,000 Things to Eat. We also have things that go and things under the sea. And these are really awesome because they expose you to new things, but it's literally filled with 1,000 things that you can eat from all over the world, and it's separated into categories. This is home baking, and you've got stuff that goes in your pantry, fish and meats. There's even a sweet section, Italian or a Spanish restaurant, just a really good book 
to help learn new things, but also so they can point, you know, can you find this? You can use it as a search book. My kids like to come back if we try a new food and see if it's actually inside this book. And these have the thicker pages, so it's not a board book really, but it's thicker than regular paper, so it's still really sturdy for little hands. And those are some of our best selections, in my opinion, of things for the youngest members of your family. I hope that you saw something that caught your eye.